Hey everyone, how's it going? In this tutorial, we're going to create a fragrance, a perfume poster design with a feminine concept and game. Let's begin. Okay, first create a new file, in file, new, and I choose this A4 template, just hit OK. And bring an image here by going to file, open this layer, and just this. And scale it down by pressing Shift S. And on this version, it's slightly different. If you hold shift on the keyboard, it will create uh, the unproportional image. But if you hold control on the keyboard, it will scale proportionally. This midpoint as the pivot. Want to only hold shift. Let's make it like this. And press enter. With move tool, all the shortcut is M can drag slightly to here. Replace the sky with another image in fall. Open this layer and adjust this. Okay, with move tool, all the shortcut is M. And you can drag down to here. Drag the layer and place it below this C layer. Now what we're going to do, we're going to replace the sky with layer mask. So in the C layer, right click, add layer mask, choose this white flow opacity, then hit that. Make sure the color in this black and white by default, or you can click this icon. Then click this gradient tool, or the shortcut is G. Make sure the shape in linear, and offset I set to 0. Then on the C layer mask layer, just Drag it down. Okay. Next, let's change the color to purple. So I'm just going to click the sky color and go to color, hue and saturation, and increase the hue to more purplish color and the saturation a little. Same on the C layer. Make sure you click the original layer not the mess layer and go to color hue and saturation let's turn it up make it some purple color and the saturation and we can adjust the color too with the color temperature in colors color temperature if you go up it will create a cold color if you go down it will create a cold color look Open up another image in file, open this layer, just this, let's click convert and scale it down a little with shift S, then only hold control on the keyboard and press enter. Okay, adjust it with move tool. We can change layer mode to, just try to find the best layer mode to your project. So in this tutorial, I choose the the LCS likeness. Add more stars and fall. Open this layer and choose this. Scale it down by pressing Shift S. Then hold Control to create a proportional scale like this. Right and press Enter. Let's try to change layer mode to find the best result for your project and this tutorial is overlay and with move tool you can adjust it around here and let me adjust this hue and saturation a little in color hue and saturation just increase the saturation let's open up the preview in file open this layer and just this see convert and place the layer to the top. Scale it down by hitting Shift S. Hold Control to create a proportional scale around here. And press Enter. So just downloaded this mockup and edit it on the Photopia.com. As you can see, you can adjust the layer in here. If you want to know how to use it, you can watch Logos Mining videos how to edit your mockup. So I'm not going to explain it any further. Back to game. 
and let's adjust the contrast and color curves just make a soft contrast this to down and this to up just a little adjust the hue and saturation in color hue and saturation increase the saturation and the hue Let's clean this edge a little and this with erase tool. Click this icon and just erase it. Add a ripple by going to fall. Open this layer. Just this. Right, you can drag to the top for C3. And on here, press Shift S and hold control to create a proportional scale on here and press enter move it below the perfume again and let's change layer mode to overlay you can scale it down a little with shift s this time press shift to create the unproportional scale on here and press enter Try to reduce the opacity a little. Create a reflection. Duplicate this perfume layer. Click this icon. Then flip it with this icon. Or the shortcut is Shift F. Make sure you choose the vertical if you want to flip vertically. Okay, with Move Tool, press M. And place it to the bottom here. Let me rename this layer. And place it below the preview. Add layer mask to here by right click. Add layer mask. Choose this white full opacity, then hit it. With this black and white color, click this gradient tool or the shortcut is G. And just drag it to the top. Create some shift effect in reflection layer. Make sure you click this original layer by going to filter, distort, and choose shift. Then let's increase it. Add a mist or the fog brushes with paint brush tool. Or the shortcut is P. And change it to. You can download the brush in the link in the description and it's easy to install. So just change it to white color and create new layer. And name it for the mist. Place the layer below the ripple. And start to brush with the mist brushes. Okay, you can reduce the opacity. Add petal particles by going to fall. Open this layer. Just this. And just place it on here. You can scale it down a little with Shift S and just drag this handle. It will scale proportionally. Add one more. Use this. Scale it down with Shift S. Okay, only drag this handle without press any button. Let's clean this edge. I'm going to use the layer mask so. Right click, add layer mask, choose this white full opacity, then hit it. Then hit it with the pen brush tool. And change the color to black. Let me change to the default brush. And just brush it. Right on these two. Right now the last, add some text element, press T and type change the font to change the size to add more text, so I'm just going to duplicate it and move it to here and change the size to okay, 
add more text. So duplicate this text and place it on here. Some text to Let's add more. Change the text to EDP. Ooh, the buffer. Make the perfume more stand out. You can create the light glow below the perfume. So below the perfume layer, create new layer, animate the light glow. Then with white color, and click this pen brush tool. Okay, then reduce the hardness to 10. And on this layer, just brush and follow the perfume shape. Let's create a Gaussian blur in filter, blur, just the Gaussian blur. Let's increase it. Let's try to change layer mode. Find the best. Try overlay. Add a vignette in filter, like in shadow, just the vignette. Right? You can we can adjust it. That's it people, I hope you learned something new in game, how to create this poster and use some techniques, especially how to blend with layer mode to create a nice background setup. I'm Zeki from Zeki Design, create something good today. Thanks for watching. Thank you.